There's a player up there, I think. Running. Yeah. Yeah, there. Bomb. Nice hit. He needs he to bound it. Her. Yeah, he does. He might stop in the house. If you had any sense, you go up uphill. Yeah. So we kind of looked around and we decided, like, maybe this dude went up to commands military. Just maybe. Let's find out. If you get into trouble, I've always got a gas grenade on me anyway. Mm hmm. Where did you find it? Mm, off one of the guys I killed oh, yeah, the other yeah. day. Yeah. I don't think there's anybody overlooking the base building. I do not hear movement inside. Zombies just spawned. Doors open though. Is that you shivering? Mm, I think it might have been. I'm not cold, but I think it could have been my character. Picking up ammo. Checking downstairs first. Mm -hmm. There's not anything you sort of loot downstairs. I found me. two gonna... boxes of ammunition. Oh, I'm gonna go up. Are you going up the stairs? Yeah. Okay. And a night vision strap. Nice. Which is good because mine's damaged to hell. Oh, one down. Ah, oh, my gun's jumped. Did you know that one I was on me? What the fuck is going on with my guns? Oh, it's working now. I don't know if the magazine could be fucked. Yeah, the magazine's damaged. That's the only reason why. Be careful. I'm gonna reload my pistol. I locked myself in. Zombies in there. Are you shooting? Yeah. Nothing. I'm gonna reload my pistol again.
the fuck? And the room, or I do not see him time to move. Switch processions. Okay, he's still in there. Oh, fuck you. Near the front. So that was a pretty bizarre death in my opinion, but it is what it is. Maybe I'm completely wrong about it, but I got shot from in front and there was nobody that I could see unless he was like outside in a tree, which I don't think so. And that guy that dropped inside of the building that looked like a zombie or something. Um, but the zombie was holding a gun and everything, so I don't know what was going on. The following clips are out of sync, but they're still pretty funny. And this is what happens when you try to play DayZ when you're extremely tired from work. Did 
Did I trade? Did I trade? It was an awful shot though, but I saw him too late. Hello. You have a gun on your back. Yeah. One guy here, friend. Where the fuck is he? Kill you. Come back here, please. Oh, fuck off, man. No, I want your helmet. Fuck you. You're shooting me. No, that's not. I was shooting the flies. Help me! He tried to kill me, hit this douchebag here. Kill him. This douchebag is my friend, you fucker. Oh, he, he should you like you. You tried to kill him, ah, He should, uh, come he here, should you fuck fucker. up. Come here, you fucker, you fucker. Come here, you fucker. Run like a pussy, huh? Oh, fuck you, douchebags. Oh, you were lucky. Oh, my God. Well, this is some... At least it's fun, because I'm not going to be online for that long. Then after that, it's just the normal fresh spawn thing, looting back up and heading back up north. Don't let me walls. Annoying douchebags. Reload. Pioneers are pretty silent. So Unless there's somebody really close by. Two barks, just in case. Oh yeah, we, we don't need a second one. We have um, we have the paper.
Go away, wolves. I already dealt with you. How far is the care package? Way too far. That was a decent shot. Was it just one? Maybe the one that got away. Or not. Uh, come in. Make yourself at home. Let's hope that was the last of them. Okay, we see smoke coming from a chimney. That's good for us and bad for them. So let's figure out how we could tackle this thing without dying ourselves. So if you're gonna do this like be on the lookout or a stakeout when it comes to like a base or location that you want to overwatch, it's best for you to find like a decent spot while you wait. My first thing thought was like I'm just gonna jump on top of this hail bell. This has like a pretty decent sideline directly at the door. But later on I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll maybe I'll just be too much exposed like laying on this white surface, so I don't think this is a good spot, so let's move. Okay, the next spot is a bush, which would be much more effective if I had a ghillie. But it's not a bad spot, but also not the best. Like if people walk by you, they will like I'm pretty sure I will get spotted like right away, unless I'm wearing a ghillie. It also depends on your clothing, of course. And this is our final spot. Like we're laying flat on the ground, you're not gonna get find another well, a better spot than this unless you go further back. Well, waiting here sure was like not a waste of our time. Let's do this. That's one. That's two. So let's find out if we can like kill this third dude or at least make sure that he will not interfere with the looting progress. Yeah, okay, I saw him.
So let's try to loot these guys. We still have to worry about the third dude inside, even though he's pretty badly injured because I heard him moan. But for now, my what I want to do is like grab what I need and go. Like one of them had the boxes of nails on him. That's already like worth the, the kills, you know, and the time I spent here. Like nails are like pretty valuable. I could have like grabbed more stuff, but I did not want to risk dying, you know. So let's try to one more time to see if we can spot this dude and kill him, just so we can like grab more loot. But I do think he's on the upper floor, and he's just waiting for his bodies to return or like himself to heal, I don't know. Maybe the rage quit for today, who knows. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Let's not overstay our welcome and just go.